hello you guys welcome back to my channel welcome back to another video by your truly india taylor as y'all can see the hair is is very different today we switched it up like majorly today in today's video i'm going to be installing this wig it's this eight inch curly wig from love me hair the specific title and the link and all that will be in the description box for sure but that's what we're doing today and it's completely glueless so i literally installed this super quick and yeah it's just different i've never tried anything like this before but i think it's really cute y'all will see the different emotions i go through installing this wig as you watch the video but yeah so i'm just installing this showing y'all how i do it like i said it's pretty quick and easy straight to the point so yeah if y'all want to see how i got this look this new look, this interesting look. Just continue watching and let's get into the video. What's up y'all? Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another video by yours truly, India Taylor. As y'all know, when y'all see me like this, we're doing a wig. <laughs> and let me just say, I'm in a new setting. I've moved again. I'm in my senior year of college, so I'm in a new apartment building so this is my new space kind of the same decoration but this is the new space this will be the new background that y'all see in my videos so just wanted to say that first but yeah um i'm gonna just get right into it because this is gonna be a really quick video i'm installing this wig from love me hair they sent me this cute little short unit i've never done anything like this before so i'm excited to see what it looks like so it's a glueless wig it's a literally like an eight inch curly wig and i know y'all probably can't see the vision yet but once i put it on y'all will see so here is the inside it is a it's not even a closure wig it has like this one little part well this little space for the parting and that's the only lace that there is in the front and then it has clips like any other wig elastic thingies at the bottom to you know secure it and then the elastic band in the back so a lot of security it is meant to be worn glueless so i will be doing it completely glueless today or try to at least um, I did make the elastic bands as tight as they go so I'm hoping that that'll like keep it on but yeah that's what we're doing today it should be really quick I'm real excited I feel like this is gonna be cute and yeah let's get into it <laughs> before we put it on I'm obviously starting off with this cap all I did was put a little bit of this fit me powder on the cap and also in the little um, space where the lace is if y'all hear a lot of background noise, I'm very sorry. That car was very loud. But yeah, it's it's loud. But um, yeah, so that's all I did. I cleaned my forehead off with some alcohol like I always do. That is ghetto. Yeah, so I'ma just put them on, put her on. Why do I call the wig a him? It's always a her. <laughs> I'm gonna put her on, see what she looking like, and yeah. Actually, y'all, uh, before I put it on, I'm actually gonna cut the lace off. I'm just gonna go ahead and do that before I even put it on. I don't usually do that, but I'm trying something different today. So I'm just gonna comb the hair back, take some normal scissors, and cut the lace in like a jagged motion. Y'all know the deal. Y'all know how wigs go. And whenever I do like closure wigs, I always cut off that thick piece right at the end. I don't know, it just makes me feel better about the whole install. <laughs> Cause I feel like that piece is just so thick for what? So I always cut it off. All right y'all, the lace is cut. This is what it looks like. Like I said, I cut in like a jagged motion. And now, we're gonna put her on. I'm excited. Okay, this is her right when I put her on. It's giving, I'm not gonna say that. It's giving crazy right now but we're gonna fix her up and make her look bomb so first thing i'm gonna do is just comb back that edge i will say that lace is, is blending it's doing what it needs to do 
So I'm just combing that back. And what I do want to do is change the shape of this part. I kind of want it to, and I don't think I'm going to do baby hairs on this wig, which is something I never say, but I do want to change the shape of this part. I want it to kind of start here and curve. So I'm just going to work on that. And I'm going to use this mousse to help me out. We'll also use this to define the curls, but this is a tight shape. Teach Lab Foam Wrap Lotion for all curl types and natural styling. So I'm gonna take this, use this to help me mold, and also when it's time to define our curls. I did nothing to this wig at all. I didn't wash it. Um, it's straight out the box. Straight out the box, y'all. I didn't do nothing to it. So this is it. Right when you get it. Didn't bleach the knots. Did nothing to her. So, yeah. All right, so I got my part how I want it. Y'all, this looks really crazy, but I promise it's gonna turn out cute. I got my part how I want it. So now I'm gonna take my spray bottle just with regular water. I'm gonna spray it to start defining the curls and I'm also gonna use the foam, like I said, and my detangling brush to comb that all, brush that all out, define the curls, get it real nice and juicy. It's a little puffy right now, so we gonna fix all of that. But yeah, I'ma just let y'all watch me do that and come back and I might have lied, I might do a little baby hair, but we'll see when we come back. <laughs> The curls are mostly, well, they are defined, and it's looking not cute at all. <laughs> I think when it dries up, it'll definitely look better. But for now, like I said, I lied. I thought I wasn't gonna make an edge, but I am gonna do a little edge right here. And I'm also just going to take this Fit Me powder again and just go along the hairline in the part to make it even more um, realistic and make it blend. Just a little bit, not too much. All right, and so I'm gonna do my little edge. I'm literally just gonna cut out like this front piece and have it blend into the curls like so. And yeah, hopefully it dries up a little bit more because I feel like it'll look better, like I said, once it's dry. So I'm gonna do that. Probably just lay it down with my little foam and yeah. Like it was doing it for eons. Funk it, I just hum and let the watch give up the neons. When it rains, it pours. I laugh to myself when I change the score. You said my sex was a lot, but my brain gave you more. Huh? Something about how your ex was a toy. I guess. Ladies and gentlemen, there's something about this yeah. girl, man. Also, y'all, my mirror is right in front of me, so these angles might just all be bad. I'm sorry in advance. 
Okay, so now that I did that, this is basically it. I will wait personally until it like dries a little bit and I might come back or I might even just grab my blow dryer and just blow it, dry it a little bit to speed the process up and then I'll come back and give y'all a look at the final result. All right, y'all, so I feel like the lighting is not giving. All right, so I just went and blow dried it a little bit. It's a little bit bigger, but the curls are still defined. And I actually like it like this. I think this is very cute, especially with the curls like hanging in the front of the face. But yeah, this is what it looks like, y'all. Ah, hold on. The lace. Let me lift it up and show y'all completely glue this, okay? Y'all just saw me do that, no glue whatsoever. Like I said, that was very quick, that was very easy. I probably did that in like 30, 45 minutes. Maybe not even 45, maybe 30. But yeah, this was this lovely wig from Love Me Hair. Um, I will definitely put all the details in the description box for sure, the link. The details of the wig all of that will be down there so check that out and go shop with them i did one of, i did a one other um wig review of theirs and that wig was bomb too so i actually really like their hair the hair is super soft the curls super easy to define did not shed much at all and i think this is just like a cute fun little wig to put on i've never had like hair this short honestly and y'all i used to like say that i wanted to cut my hair so that i like do a big chop and this is low-key like what i would have like my curls will obviously not be this um <laughs> loose but i always said i wanted to do a big chop and this is like well maybe a little shorter than this but yeah i think this is kind of cute let me like show y'all all sides so obviously this is the front it's the side this side and in the back real cute real 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 cute real flirty real subtle you know what i'm saying but yeah this is her i did not fully dry it so like i said as it just dries i feel like it's gonna look better and better but yeah i hope y'all enjoyed watching it i hope y'all got something from it as always if you haven't already like comment on this video share it please and subscribe if you have not already and also click that bell so you can be notified every time i post a new video y'all i have been slacking so bad with like consistency it's really hard <laughs> i do have like videos in the fall you know what i'm saying that just needs to be edited and put up so more coming there with the college student okay the hbcu howard college student i'm saying i've got a howard shirt on i don't but yeah <laughs> bear with me y'all i'm trying i'm really trying but love y'all thanks for watching if you made it all the way to the end love you even if you didn't love you and yeah Thank y'all, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye, guys. Ladies and gentlemen, there's something about this girl, man. From around my way. Never try to hold back your